Oregon has some of the best chefs in the entire world, and Oregon is for foodies. I'm very excited to go into the Loft restaurant and see what Chef Jeremy has to cook up for us today. Hi, I'm Jeremy Vidalo Singh, and I'm the executive chef and co-owner of Loft, Brasserie, and Bar in Ashland, Oregon. Today we're going to make a uh, classic bistro dish, our version of that, um, a seafood bouillabaisse. We've got our shrimp, our manila clams, our pen cove mussels. Uh, this is our bouillabaisse broth, which is a tomato, saffron, and fennel broth that we make with a, uh, a homemade halibut stock that I put on this morning. And then we've got our fresh Alaskan halibut, and then a nice uh, large U10 dayboat scallop. La Frasserie is a French-American bistro. Uh, we do a lot of classic French bistro dishes. A lot of the ingredients uh, that we use here, we try to utilize ingredients from the Pacific Northwest. Now this is going to be the start of our bouillabaisse broth. So I've got some shallots here, a little bit of ground garlic. And while our seafood is cooking, we're going to throw in some sliced baguette. And this is a roasted garlic and anise butter that's on this bread. So we're going to lightly toast this. So we're going to brown that garlic real lightly. And then we're going to add our, uh, some herb roasted fingerling potatoes. We're going to add our manila clams. And then we're going to add our bouillabaisse broth. Add our mussels to it. And then going to put a lid on that and let, let that steam and open up our mussels and clams. Do a quick check on our seafood. Go ahead and flip it. I like to flip it over about halfway of cooking. And oftentimes when I'm cooking um, scallops or a piece of fish, um, I like to finish it by just basting it with some butter. And then you don't want to let the butter brown too much, but just enough to give it some broth almost to just baste the seafood with. Right. Add our shrimp to our bouillabaisse last, as well as some fresh herbs. And we want to thicken our sauce up just a touch so it's not really cook all that seafood flavor into it. And then here I've got a Rui sauce, which is a uh, roasted uh, pepper and saffron aioli. This is going to go on top of our crostinis here, just a little bit. And this aioli is just kind of a classic pairing uh, to a bouillabaisse. Put our potatoes in the middle, kind of lay around our shellfish, our shrimp. Pour in our broth. Put on our crostinis. The saffron aioli. And then just some fresh herbs over the whole thing, which flat leaf parsley, a little bit of tarragon. And that's the uh, lost version of the classic bistro display base with fresh Alaskan halibut and bay boat scallops and Pacific shellfish. Bon appetit. Very Oregon and very French. I love it. I'm here with Jacqueline, one of the owners, and Chef Jeremy is your husband, and you guys run yeah. this restaurant together. And the food is amazing, I have to say. Thank you. And this is your patio. Yes. Um, we're actually in the process of expanding the patio space. Uh, we're going to go straight through. We're going to extend um, the bar, so we'll have a more full bar access. Uh, 15 feet, beautiful granite bar. Ten bar stools, lovely solarium style glass dining, so indoor outdoor space. And then our patio will extend as well, and we're gonna do a lounge fire pit oh, out there. So nice. Yeah, with the fire's going right through the glass. Amazing. It's gonna be phenomenal come the end of June. Thank you for being on Oregon Lifestyle. Oh, thank you so much. It's been a pleasure. A pleasure. Thank you so much. Love you.